Hi, this is Dr. Mark Vizona. In this segment, Madi and I will be simulating a collaborative writing project on Google Docs. In this simulation, we are students who have been tasked with a partner writing assignment, and we are using Google Docs to work on the assignment together. First, we need to create a new document. I will click on New and Google Docs. I'll rename the document so that we can easily find it later. Now I want to share the doc with Madi so that we can work on it together. I will click Share and click Get Shareable Link on the top right-hand corner. Select anyone with the link can edit. Copy the link under anyone with the link can edit and send your link to your group members in the Canvas messaging group set up by your mentor. Write some content in the document, then leave a comment to get Madi's input on the draft. How I do that is I highlight the portion of the doc I want the comment to attach to, then I click on this button that pops up on the right. I asked him what we should include in the paper so that I can start working on the outline. After Madi replies to my comment, I can see what he suggests in his reply. Once he replied with the components that we should include in our paper, I started typing out the outline. Once I finished the outline, I asked Mati for his input. He thinks it looks good, but he also thinks that it should be more detailed and fleshed out. I agree, so I went back into the outline to add in more details. Here we're just working on building up the outline together. As you can see, all the edits being made occur in real time too, so here I'm just reading what Mati is adding to the outline. When I think of something, I can also edit the doc at the same time, even while Mahdi is typing. After we have a better handle on the outline, I started drafting our introduction. Using the button after highlighting text, Mahdi can leave comments on places he wants me to take a look at. I can reply to his comments like so. It looks like he's asking me for more information on this bullet point because it sounds too general to him, so I'm replying to his comment to explain my rationale. It looks like Mahdi has taken a look at my comment and responded. He provided an idea for us to incorporate my suggestion. Now that the issue has been resolved, I can click on Resolve over here. That removes the comment so that everyone in the doc knows that the issue has been addressed. Google Docs also has this Explore function that suggests related content for the doc. It pulls images and web pages from the internet that are related to our topic. I decided to search for something specific to see if I can find some resources for us to incorporate into our paper. I found a link to examples from thebalancedcareers.com on how to write formal letters, which is what we want to do for this collaborative exercise. I want to share this with Madi, so I clicked on the link to go to the web page, copy the link from the URL bar, and commented it to Madi via the comment function. With all that being said, Google Docs is a great tool for collaborative writing. The comment and explore functions especially are useful for all stages of the writing process, from planning to drafting, revising, editing, and finally proofreading.